Hey guys, check this out. You know what that is? This guy right here, this guy. That's a helping hand. My church is doing this really cool helping hands project where we're donating a bunch of time uh, and a bunch of people to help projects around our area. I'm working at a YMCA right now. So we're gonna go clean up the YMCA and sanitize everything and, and uh, power wash stuff and it's gonna be good times. I sent a picture out on uh, Instagram. So if you follow me on Twitter, you'll see the, all the people that we had at our church building um, who volunteered to do this and it's actually a really cool project so you can check out just look up Mormon Helping Hands on Google and you'll see all about it Come on dad Give up the keys. I gotta take a spin with the girls Come on dad give up the keys Give them up watch she wants to grab them, but she can't she's not coordinated enough yet watch I'll set them there and then she'll try to get them and then she'll drop them And there they go. And we'll put them back. Right there. <laughs> oh, Hazel, you want those keys so bad? Oh, Hazel, you want those keys so bad? <laughs> yeah, that was so cute. Do you laugh? It's so cute. Oh, she's trying to bite them. <laughs> oh, man, she's trying to bend over to bite them. Oh, she's drooling on them. Oh. Drooly keys. Oh, that's so nice. A big drooly drool. Thank you. And look, my button broke. And I have to reach in there with a wet finger to lock my car. But it automatically locks, so it's not a big deal. You ready to go to Target? To exchange your G.I. Joe? Briggy, briggy, briggy boy? You don't even care, do you? That is some serious bedhead. Let me see this hair. Come here, let me see. Come here, let me see. Come here, come here, come here. What, babe? Dolly's friend that is um Jessica. Can I get another dolly to be her friend? No, you're her friend. No, I want um another Barbie friend to be her friend. You have lots of Barbies. I know, but we should look in your room and see if you have one that's her size. I think you already do. I only have two of them. I want more. Well, then they should be friends. Ginger, no, we're gonna go exchange Brigham's. We're not gonna get a new one. Well, if we do, it's gonna be for Daddy. <laughs> so check this out. We are. Hippies, not really. We're dehydrating some bananas and some strawberries, and we, uh, Darcy's mom gave us this dehydrator, and it's like from the 70s or something, and we just cut up some strawberries. We came into some really cheap strawberries, and rather than let them go bad, we just cleaned them up, cut them up, and we had a bunch of extra bananas too. So we're doing some bananas and some strawberries, and they're gonna be delicious. You wanna try this one, Ginger? Yeah. It's not quite ready yet, but it's still gonna be good. Mmm. Is it banana-y? Yeah. A little and soft. It's, but it's a little awesome. soft. Yeah, but it's gonna get harder. And it's literally just fruit that you. It's, uh, it gets like 135 uh, degrees, I want some more. and then um, Can I try blows the, the warm air across it, and uh, it is delicious. Yeah, you can try that one. And uh, wants a strawberry. You want a little strawberry? There you go. Is that yummy. We're gonna go to the store and get another one. Good guy. The same one, but... What if they're out of good guys? Then what do we do? Look for a good guy. If they ran out of the good guys, we're gonna have to get a bad guy. We're good guys, come on! Have good guys, people. Come on. So... That's what we're gonna do. Get a bad guy if there's no good guys. So Mama ditched us again. She's not gonna let us come to a movie. What? So what's girls' night out, Ginger? That means um, the girls are with the girls. Yep, all the girls get together and they go for a night out. Yeah, somewhere. You know where they're going? Huh? Camping. They're gonna stay out in the desert all night, the snakes. Snakes? No, they're just going to dinner because there's a bunch of birthday parties, or birthdays this month. So they're going to go tell all the girls happy birthday. Um, the girls who have birthdays? Yep. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to... We're not going. We're going to it's not, it's not ditch Daddy mommy. It's and mommy and girls night out. It's just girls night out. Yeah, not boys and me night out and kids. Not boys and kids, it's just girls. All right, Ginger, so guess what? First off, look how cute that baby is. Second, you're here at Target with Daddy. 
know what that means? Daddy makes up the rules. And the rule for tonight, we're gonna share a Slurpee. Have you ever had a Slurpee? I don't think you've ever had a Slurpee, have you? We're gonna get a Slurpee. What is Slurpee? Slurpee? A Slurpee is like an ice, an ice cone, ice cream. Well, it's like shaved ice, uh -huh. right? And it's got like cherry flavor or blueberry flavor. It's gonna be delicious. You'll see. Red cherry. You think so? I don't know. I think I want to try the orange or the lemon lime. Well, I want to try. How about I put a little bit of cherry at the bottom, and then some lemon lime, and then some orange. Yeah, and we can mix it up. No. Yeah. I want to taste the different flavors. Wait, does it look yummy? No. Oh, here, taste it, taste it, taste it. I taste it. My brother taste it. I'm gonna be in so much trouble if mommy watches this video. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Can I try one? <laughs> Uh oh, brain freeze. Is that good, brother? You gotta be careful, otherwise your brain freezes. <laughs> it's true. What does that mean? Your brain freezes, then it hurts. Your brain doesn't really freeze, it just hurts. What are you doing? Are you eating that? We need to get you your pacifier. Here, where's your pacifier? There it is. There it is. There you go. Happy baby now? Are you happy, baby? Oh, wow. Yeah, that's, oh, yeah. It's a cake. You know, that's how many candles mommy's going to need on her next cake. It's like, Daddy, you're in trouble. You better not have said that. Song. Dance, Brigham. Dance. <laughs> okay, get the blue. That was the safety dance song. This one? No, the blue one. Ba oh, balloon? Yeah. Well, they said blue. <laughs> <laughs> Those cards funny? <laughs> okay, now get okay. Um, the kid one. The what kid one. It's behind that balloon. Here, this one looks like it'll be funny. It, we already did this one. We did? Mm. Are you happy or mad? <laughs> Are you dancing too, dude? Dance! <laughs> is it horrible that it's Saturday night and this is what we're doing? <laughs> Darcy, you're in trouble for ditching us. That's all I have to say. So here's this one. Try that one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, we gotta go. I decided to take the kids. Thanks, dude. You're helping out. I decided to take the kids on a little bit of a, a, a treat out tonight, and I went and got some gas to fill up Darcy's car because she was almost empty. But then I drove up the side of this mountain where Darcy and I go shooting, and at night it's beautiful because you can see the city lights and. It's just really nice. So I thought I'd bring Ginger out here and let her enjoy the beautiful view and bring him too. And bring him. Is it pretty? I'm gonna what get What do you out. see? Do you see lights? No, don't get out, babe. There's all kinds of stuff on the ground that you could hurt yourself with. So just you could poke out and look. You can look Ava. out the back here. Ava. So I'm gonna show you guys Ava. the lights. Ava. The lights from the city. Yeah, there's bullets all over the ground right there. You can't really see them. But yeah, look at that. Look at that. How pretty that is. Isn't that awesome? It looks so much farther away in the camera. But it's really, it's probably like that, for real. <laughs> That's what it looks like to my eye. About like that. But the camera looks at it like that, so. It looks like we're really far out, but we're really not. It looks like, wow, that, it looks so little. But there's mountains. There's mountains there covering, and there's mountains there covering it up. Anyway, it's just really pretty to come out here at night because, um, Yeah, there's bullets on the ground. Those are shotgun shells. Oh, you gotta go potty? Oh, we gotta cut our visit short out here then. We need to go home, huh? Or do you wanna just pee out in the dirt? Out in the dirt. Do we have baby wipes? Um, no. We don't have any baby wipes. Then what are we gonna wipe me with? We're gonna go home and wipe you. 
Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna go because you gotta go potty, so let's go. I can try to hold it. Well, no, I don't want you to pee on yourself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just saw a flashing light. Oh, yeah. There's a car driving down there. Way down there, yeah. That's where the regular road is, and we came up from there. Show me your tomato. It's a seed. It tomato. looks like a seed? Yeah. Are you gonna eat it? I think it looks it? like a raindrop. You know who loves tomatoes? Who? Who do you think? Brigham. I know. Who? Brigham. Brigham does I you're said pretty. Brigham. Look at you how pretty you are. Look at you trying to get brownie points. I'm not trying to get brownie points. I'm just telling you how pretty you are. Oh! I said Brigham. <laughs> Alright. A raindrop. A okay, raindrop. here up and eat it because Hazel's starting to cry. Swerp. 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 <laughs> Your baby's crying. Oh, I need to go potty. What are you doing? She's crying. Listen, She's I've been crying. holding it all this time. She gotta go take care of her. Listen to that cry. Where's your passy? I don't know. Bring them. Was it yummy tomatoes? Did you finish? Eat your tomatoes. Eat those tomatoes right there, the yellow ones. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> Have bites! Have bites! Come on! Look at this conglomeration of food here. He's got banana and pizza and tomato and a little bit of salsa. Kid, and he wants more of these. No, eat. Okay, I'll give you a red one. I'll give you a red mater. Give him a this one. one. Here you go. There's your red mater. Well, it looks just like mine. Have a bite! Eat it! Yummy tomato. Okay, I'm gonna eat it then. Here, give it to Daddy. More. Okay, here you go. More. No, you need to eat that one, dude. Do you want this one instead? Do you want this one? No, give me that one then. There you go, you can have that one. Mmm. He is a tomato eating fool, man. He loves them. Look how you're, tall I am right now with you. Yeah, what are you doing? Did you bring stilts home? No. Oh. I don't know about those shoes. Oh. Oh. Why? Are they a little S L U T T Y? <laughs> are they? Let's see. No, they're not. They're good. They're just real tall. I know, look at this. I know, I'm like, I should get some heels so that I don't feel so short next to you now. I'm like almost to your eyebrow. You, no, you're to my nose. Here. <laughs> to my nose, right? And then this is me normal. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Okay. Stand up and there you go. Oh, hey. Poor dark, poor short people. I always, this is like an inside joke and like an ongoing joke. I, I always ask Alex, what's it like to be tall? He's like, normal? I'm like, no, seriously, what's it like to like see over the tops of cars? I have no idea. That's true. I really don't know. You have to what's try to like look to through the reach the top of the fridge? You can reach the top of the I fridge. I can't touch the top of the fridge. I can't get those bags down that you put on top you know, of the fridge. I think that's just an excuse that she doesn't have to do stuff on the top of the fridge. Because we're about to watch her reach the top of the fridge or run now. We'll open the fridge first. Well, I shouldn't have to go through all the rigmarole. But now you have the In stilts. these shoes I can. <coughs> oh! So now you don't need me. Uh, I'm out. Oh, please. And like this stuff? Oh, now you can do it. I can't get that stuff out. Yeah, but you could look in there and see if it's in there first before you send me on wild goose chases. Whatever, I know it's in there already. Yeah, alright. Come on, dude. Eat your oh, you ate your mater already? It's time for bed. Let's go. Where's your bed? Here, you forgot this piece. Eat this one. It's mater mater. Let go. Mm -hmm. What did you did you really just spit that out? It's the same thing that you just ate. Yeah, Yucky, that was no good. That was no good, that one. You ready for bed? You ready for bed? Oh, I usually give him a little bottle of milk, but I probably upset his stomach. Let's look at our bananas and strawberries. Oh, dang! They're still a little bit flexible. A little bit flexible, but they're doing pretty good. And the bananas, oh, they're still a little squishy. Oh, the thin ones are good. 
Oh, they're gonna be so good by the morning. Let's see. Oh, those are good. All right, well, it's um, I just have to leave it on all night, I guess. Wow, those are gonna be tasty, man. That's gonna be awesome church food for tomorrow. And I didn't let Ginger play with the GI Joe; she got all upset. But tomorrow during church, we're gonna play with him. So she'll have to wait till then. All right, it's bedtime. It's bedtime. Let's go to bed. More what? More, you know, more another tomato? You're gonna eat this whole thing of tomatoes, dude. Mama. Eat that one. It's bedtime, it's bedtime, time to get in bed. It's bedtime, it's bedtime, time to get in bed. So what happened to your tattoo? Some of it fell off, so Daddy drew a shark eating half a shark. Yeah, we got this cool tattoo. She got a cool tattoo for at her school. And Brigham, are you okay? She had a cool tattoo at her school and um, it messed up. for being good. And then she got it a little bit wet before we put it on, so it messed up. And it's a dolphin, so I just put it on her and then we drew a shark uh, eating the dolphin. Isn't that cool? Now it's a cool tattoo and not just some sissy dolphin.